A psalm of David, the prophet and king. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. I will sing, even sing psalms to the Lord. Hear, O Lord, my voice, which I have uttered aloud. Pity me, and hearken to me, my heart said to you, Halli, Eloia. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. John. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. Now there were certain Greeks among those who came up to worship at the feast. Then they came to Philip, who was from this side of Galilee, and asked him, saying, Sir, we wish to see Jesus. Philip came and told Andrew, and in turn Andrew and Philip told Jesus. But Jesus answered them, saying, The hour has come that the Son of Man should be glorified. Most assuredly I say to you, Unless a grain of wheat falls into the ground and dies, it remains alone. But if it dies, it produces much grain. He who loves his life will lose it, and he who hates his life in this world will keep it for eternal life. If anyone serves me, let him follow me, and where I am, there my servant will be also. If anyone serves me, him my father will honor. Now my soul is troubled, and what shall I say, Father, save me from this hour? But for this purpose I came to this hour. Father, glorify your name. Then a voice came from heaven, saying, I have both glorified it and will glorify it again. Therefore the people who stood by and heard it said that it had thundered. Others said, An angel has spoken to him. Jesus answered and said, This voice did not come because of me, but for your sake. Now is the judgment of this world. Now the ruler of this world will be cast out. And I, if I am lifted up from the earth, will draw my peoples to myself. This he said, signifying by what death he would die. The people answered him, We have heard from the law that the Christ remains forever, and how can you say the Son of Man must be lifted up? Who is this Son of Man? Then Jesus said to them, A little while longer the light is with you. Walk while you have the light, lest darkness overtake you. He who walks in darkness does not know where he is going. While you have the light, believe in the light, that you may become sons of light. Bow down before the Holy Gospel. Glory be to God for ever. A psalm of David, the prophet and king. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. Save your people and bless your inheritance. And take care of them. And lift them up forever. Hearken to the voice of my supplication. When I pray to you. Alleluia. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. And it happened as he was alone praying that his disciples joined him and he asked them, saying, Who do the crowds say that I am? So they answered and said, John the Baptist. But some say Elijah, and others say that he is one of the old prophets risen again. He said to them, But who do you say that I am? Peter answered and said, The Christ of God. And he strictly warned and commanded them to tell no one, saying, The Son of Man must suffer many things and be rejected by the elders and chief priests and scribes 
and be killed and be raised the third day bow before the holy gospel glory be to god for ever A psalm of David the prophet and king. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. Bring to the Lord, you sons of God. Bring to the Lord, young rams. Bring to the Lord glory and honor. Bring to the Lord the glory due to his name. Worship the Lord in his holy court. Alleluia. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. Now they were on the road going up to Jerusalem, and Jesus was going before them. And they were amazed, and as they followed, they were afraid. Then he took the twelve aside and began to tell them the things that would happen to him. Behold, we are going up to Jerusalem, and the Son of Man will be betrayed to the chief priests and to the scribes, and they will condemn him to death and deliver him to the Gentiles. And they will mock him and scourge him and spit on him and kill him. And the third day he will rise again, bow before the Holy Gospel. Glory be to God forever. A psalm of David the prophet and king, may his blessings be with us all, amen. I have cried for you, heard me, O God. Incline your ear to me and listen to my words. O Lord of my righteousness, attend to my petition. Give ear to my prayer, alleluia. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. Now Jesus and his disciples went out to the towns of Caesarea Philippi, and on the road he asked his disciples, saying to them, Who do men say that I am? So they answered John the Baptist, but some say Elijah, and others one of the prophets. He said to them, But who do you say that I am? Peter answered and said to him, You are the Christ. Then he strictly warning them that they should tell no one about him, began to teach them that the Son of Man must suffer many things and be rejected by the elders and chief priests and scribes and be killed and after three days rise again he spoke this word openly then peter took him aside and began to rebuke him but when he had turned around and looked at his disciples he rebuked peter saying get behind me satan for you are not mindful of the things of God, but the things of men. Bow before the Holy Gospel. Glory be to God forever. A psalm of David the prophet and king. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. He will deliver me from my mighty enemies and from them that hate me, for they are stronger than I. They prevented me in the day of my affliction. Alleluia. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. Then the disciples came to Jesus privately and said, 
why could we not cast it out? So Jesus said to them, because of your unbelief, for assuredly I say to you, if you have faith as a mustard seed, you will say to this mountain, move from here to there, and it will move, and nothing will be impossible for you. However, this kind does not go out except by prayer and fasting. Now when they were staying in Galilee, Jesus said to them, The Son of Man is about to be betrayed into the hands of men, and they will kill him, and the third day he will be raised up. And they were exceedingly sorrowful. Bow before the Holy Gospel. Glory be to God for ever.